Okay, morning. So we left Ipupa Falls yesterday and then drove all along the river. The Kuneni River, quite a challenging road. Um, not easy towing a, a van at the back, but yeah, we made it to Ruakana. Saw the uh, water, or the dam there, um, with the hydroelectric plant. And then from Ruakana, we made our way now to Kawaliap, um, where we're staying at Opikopi. Um, very nice place. Central, nice food, good bar, good accommodation. So, <coughs> yeah, so we are really um, pushing the, the kilometers. I think we did almost four and a half thousand kilometers till today. Um, so about another 3,000 to go. So Opikopi, it's uh, self-catering or you can dine in at the restaurant. Um, I think the bar is famous for being the best bar in the, in the region. And then they also have some camping spots available. So this is the, the dining area. Some bird life here as well. Swimming pool. I think it's a must when it's too warm, definitely to come and have a swim. We're making our way today from here towards Uis, or Korigas first, and then Uis. And then we're going to stay for two nights at uh, Spitzkoppe. So we are here at the Burn Mountain site. We're going to walk towards that. Um, and then petrified organ pipes, if I'm correct. Uh, it's also like a 10 minute walk in the riverbed. traveling for us, making our way on the D2612, with every turn revealing new landscapes that captivate the eye. Finally arriving at Spitzkopper, we set up camp, eager to unwind after the day's adventures. As the sun starts to dip below the horizon, we prepare a few cold ones. While savoring the enticing aromas of the neighbor's braai, we steal glances at the mountains, their silhouettes against the twilight sky creating a mesmerizing backdrop. The tranquility of the desert night surrounds us as we settle into our camp with the promise of a new day ahead. Cheers, see you tomorrow. Okay, so today we are, well this morning actually, it's now but just after 6, we woke up for the sunrise at Spitzkoppe, um, a yeah, magnificent place, beautiful, um, something you can't really explain, you should be here to, to experience it, um, beautiful rock formations, beautiful sunrise, I mean these green, these grasslands, yellow grasslands, 
with the sunrise just looks fabulous. Um, yeah, it's definitely something worth visiting. Um, the campsite well spread it within the area, quite far apart from each other, so there's no disturbance of your neighbour. Yeah, I can really recommend um, coming here. We actually did not camp here, we camped next door, but um, next time I will definitely make the effort to camp here as well. So we're going to go now from here to Swap of Munt, where we're going to stay for about five, five days, yeah, five days, and then we're going to make our way down south. 